Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. Do I need to request a tax filing extension if I am in a federally declared disaster area? If you reside in an area that has been declared a federally declared disaster area, the IRS often provides automatic extensions for tax filing and payment deadlines. This relief is typically granted to individuals and businesses with an IRS address of record located in the affected area, so you usually do not need to request an extension explicitly. Automatic relief. The IRS automatically extends the deadlines for various tax filings and payments for taxpayers in designated disaster areas. For example, if the original deadline was April 15th, the new deadline might be extended to a later date, such as August 15th or even later, depending on the specific disaster declaration. Extended deadlines. The extended deadlines apply to several types of tax returns and payments, including individual income tax returns, business tax returns, IRA and health savings account contributions, and quarterly estimated tax payments. These deadlines are generally postponed to the same new date for both filing and payment, although payment deadlines can sometimes differ. Additional time to file. If the automatic extension period is not enough, you can still file for an additional extension. However, this must be done on paper using Form 4868, as e-file options are not available after the original deadline. This additional extension typically extends the filing deadline by six months from the original due date, not the postponed date. It's important to note that while the filing deadline can be extended, the payment deadline might remain earlier. For instance, if the new filing deadline is October 16th, you may still need to make your tax payments by the earlier postponed deadline, such as August 15th to avoid late payment penalties. Contacting the IRS. If you receive a notice about late filing or payment penalties despite being in a disaster area, you can contact the at 1-866-562-5227 to have the penalties abated. The IRS also works with taxpayers who live outside the disaster area but have records or businesses affected by the disaster. Eligibility. Tax relief is available not only to residents but also to businesses with a principal place of business in the affected area. This includes various business entities such as sole proprietors, LLC members, partnership interests, and corporate entities. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning in to our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.